Hi, my name is Taya McGarren, and this painting is called Perfect Hibiscus. It is a watercolor. Now, I don't normally paint flowers, but you know, as artists, we sometimes go through um, things that we want to experience or series that we want to explore. So I started exploring um, some of these uh, florals. And um, I did this one in watercolor, as I said. And I really loved the subtlety of the, of the colors. Now, the interesting thing on this is I was, um, uh, you know, I hadn't played a lot with watercolors in a while. And I had this palette that was full of reds. And I had never identified them. So I had no idea if they were granular or if they were, you know, transparent or more opaque. It, it was like a crapshoot. You could just, oh, whatever. And so one of the challenges that I did uh, or gave myself is to basically, well, let's explore and see how many of these reds I can use in a different manner and create something that's quite enjoyable. And so um, this is why I like that painting personally. And just, there's just a nice, beautiful flow to it. You know, there's some beautiful granulation here that happened. And uh, so for me, it was uh, an exciting exercise uh, in, uh, well, next time I'll label my reds. But I did okay anyway, so you know what? Maybe you don't have to. So I liked it so much that I decided to redo it. But like I said, I like challenges. So I redid the same painting, and if you notice, it is the same painting, but what I did here is I did what, what are called fractal planes. So I took the same shapes, and then I actually cut in other shapes within it. So it creates a more interesting space. So then the, um, the challenge became what's called a push and pull uh, technique. What's gonna come forward, what's gonna push back, and then just playing with the colors and, and, and making the background very separate from what was in here. And yet, still having uh, these colors flow nicely, and different types of yellows, and uh, different types of blues. And I like hard edges. Okay, I know you're supposed to do soft and hard, but you know what? I like hard edges. So I did this painting in a hard edge style, and um, I, I like it the way it is. It has a nice flow. Um, the colors are just beautiful. These are actually matte acrylics, so they're not shiny, and, but yet look at the impact that it has. So um, don't be afraid to experiment and try different things, you know, like from watercolors to this. This was, you know, a, a, an earlier acrylic work. I didn't really know what these acrylics were going to do, but now I know and I really like them. So change it up a bit and enjoy the whole process. Thank you very much.